Cloudy days. Haven't seen the sun in way too long. What's up, guys? How's it going? Had an awesome weekend up in Seguin. We went ATVing two days in a row, or I guess side by siding, siding, four by fouring, off roading, whatever you want to call it. But now I'm back, back to buying cars. So a few people ask me, how much do you spend a week on cars? It's about a thousand dollars, but I get all that money back plus some, cause you know, scrap, take them back to scrap. Sometimes I sell parts off them. Take the mufflers off too, the cats, they're worth something. And then all the money off the YouTube videos, so. Anyways, I lined up two cars for today. I don't know why I do this to myself every time, line two up on one day. But I know one's guaranteed now, right now. The other one, we'll see. One's in St. Thomas, so I'm heading to St. Thomas right now, pick that up. I'm gonna go show you guys what the track looks like. It's pretty muddy. And then uh, maybe we'll go swing by and get the other car later. So for now, it stopped raining. So I'm going to throw the drone up, get a quick little drone shot. And then let's go pick up this new car, this new 4x4, the twin, the twinsy. few days here sloppy 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 got the track all redone and I can't even touch it can't even touch it gotta start cutting the lawn down here though as soon as that sun comes out as you can see the weeds grow super fast down here that's why I just do donuts with cars all the time just rip everything up oh anyways you guys remember the Jimmy I almost called it a blazer the Jimmy from last week this thing is awesome a bit of a gas leak though, so can't put any gas in it because it all leaks out. But I did a burnout wide open until both tires popped. It was pretty epic. Obviously, I have a ton more tires, so I'm going to get those swapped over sometime this week. Hopefully, we have some better weather than this because it's hard to put a jack down when it's this muddy. But we will get these tires changed over. And I want to jump that Dodge. Hoping to jump it this week. So basically, I just want to use this as a push car. So the uh, Jimmy here, old Jimmy, is basically just going to be behind the Dodge. I'll go neutral to drive. It's going to go flying and maybe Brad or Justin will be in the Jimmy pushing it because we want all that extra speed and we want to see it fly. I mean, they've been flying decent lately, but the jump's still pretty soft. So we're trying to make them super fly. So. Anyways, let's head over to St. Thomas and pick up the Freshie. This week's Freshie. Favorite city. The big city of St. Thomas. Alright, surprise. Buy another Jimmy. <laughs> Twinning. Alright, let's get this beast up, load her up, get her home. This is gonna be the new push truck. To push all the vehicles, give them a little boost off the jump. This thing's sweet. <laughs> awesome. Alright, let's get her out of here. Back of the compound, we got Jimmy, we got Jimmy Jr., Jimmy Sr., we got some skull and crossbones. It is getting dark over there, so I'm going to unload this thing as fast as possible, throw the drone up in the sky, see if I can get into some quick trouble. Hopefully I don't end up at the back and it dies or something happens because that's a fire walk, but try and get some drone shots before it starts pouring. It's kind of been misty all day. Misty is just annoying. Like rain or shine figure it out let's get this thing unloaded uncle jimmy launch that drone up fire this thing up oh almost half a tank of gas in there 
that's uh, follow me. That usually helps. See if I can get her off the trailer. Yeah, all right. Here we go. starting to clear up. Thank God for this follow drone. This thing is amazing. Could probably land it. I wonder if I can just drive it over there. Oh. <laughs> Snack up on you this time. <laughs> Woo. All right. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed that. I just wanted to show getting the new Jimmy. Apparently this thing's actually got a lift in it too. So Look at that, twins. Hey Brad, it's me and you, race time, here we go. Uh, anyways, yeah, glad I purchased another one. Um, we're gonna hopefully jump the Dodge this week. It all depends on the weather. It's gotta dry out, because this, this mucky stuff does not work well with jumps. You guys saw how they can get out of control. But we have one guy, he's gonna uh, be building a, a kill switch for us. So he is a fan, he emailed me the other day said he wanted to build a kill switch and I said you know what that's probably a good idea because I'm sick of chasing cars and falling on my face and you know having them go wherever they feel like they want so anyways thank you guys again I don't know if I'm picking up that car tonight I haven't heard back from the guy yeah from the guy but uh yeah we're headed to team LTD tomorrow then I think some boating maybe some fishing I never really know what's going on there's always something going on but we got convinced Trudge to bring his three-wheeler down again, do some three-wheeling videos, maybe some goon riding. So thank you guys. Have a fantastic day, and we'll see you later. Bye.